The more the merrier with giant clams. This is a giant clam. And this is another giant clam. Giant clams can be big, small, plain, striped, with a discreet mantle, or a more flashy one. But they all have one thing in common. They need each other to survive. Because giant clams can't move, they are what we call broadcast spawners. Meaning that instead of looking for a mate far and wide, they spread out eggs and sperm that will meet in the vast ocean. Now imagine, if there aren't many giant clams around, it's harder for this fertilization to occur. And with too few giant clams, it's impossible for them to survive. Picking up a couple giant clams here and there might seem harmless, but in some areas, this actually caused all giant clams to become locally extinct. So let's be sure not to overfish. The more giant clams there will be, the safer the future for them and for us. Fish better. Fish forever. But how? Respect no-take areas. In some reserves, large numbers of giant clams are concentrated in small areas. So the fertilization has a better chance to occur. And giant clams have a better chance to thrive, which will secure future fishing. Discover other sustainable fishing practices on fame.spc.int.